Hey guys, it's me, Fistle B. Gonna want to play some more Sui Code 2. Where we last left off, let's go find Miklatov. These guys look threatening. Let's beat the shit out of them. now because he didn't come and join our party at Green Hill. His two boos are getting drunk at the frickin' castle. Layers of bones. But, on a good note, oh. should be able to get your Kennedy here. Yes, Victor will take that Thunder Amulet. Sure. I never was able to build a stupid deity. Resist fire? Holy shit. The great Lord Fist would want that, wouldn't he? Do I have anything to train with you? Good. I sold those for more money. <laughs> Master trader am am me. But where the hell is he? Oh, I'm free. <laughs> Sorry, I'm in a hurry. Dick. Hey, you are, Sir Humphrey. Say, would you like to go outside where it's warmer? No, this is fine. Er, sorry, I've stayed here so long. No, don't worry about it. You've promptly paid for your lodgings, and I know the war's a problem for all travelers. It's Harmonia you're heading for, Sir Humphrey. I guess the roads are closed because of the war. Yes. Hey, buddy. Hmm. You're late. Where have you been? Sorry, sorry. My mom had me and made me help with the chores. Chores? Hey, Fudge. You were a dragon knight, right? Huh? Uh, yeah, ninth rank, though. Just a dragon knight apprentice. So... So you've flown? Flown in the skies? On a dragon? Of course. I was born in a dragon cave. I've spent more time in the skies than on the ground. Wow, really? Really? That's awesome! It's true. Here's the proof. Is this a dragon scale? Whoa, that's cool! Hey, can I see that? I want to show it to my mom. Yeah, sure, but it means a lot to me, so don't lose it. Be super careful. Wow, it must be great to fly. That's so cool, Futch. But my dragon, Black was his name, he died, he, he died protecting me. A uh, dragon knight without a dragon. I, I can't go back to the dragon cave, I can't fly. Uh, but aren't you and Humphrey on a course to find a new dragon? Yeah. So someday, someday soon, you'll get another dragon. And you'll be a Dragon Knight again. Fudge, when that day comes, when you're a Dragon Knight again, will you let me fly with you? To fly again? Yeah. If... If I get a new Dragon, Kent, you'll be the first person I give a ride to. 
will come flying over the mountains and land right in front of your house. Really? Do you promise? Do you promise me, Fudge? Yeah, it's a promise. And my little thingy on the bottom. Oh god, you're ruining the immersion! Hmm. Well, the sure is nice today. Uh-huh. Where are you going? Harmonia. Why Harmonia? To look for dragons. Well, it looks like you two are having quite a talk, so would you like to stay here tonight? Mr. Humphrey said talking to you was nice. To express his gratitude, he paid for your lodgings tonight. Man, <laughs> if some annoying, like, 15-year-old came up to me and just started asking me stupid questions, I wouldn't pay for his lodgings. Clint Eastwood here is just such a nice guy. <laughs> Thank you for last night. Never mind. I'll leave on a good note. There we go. Alright. Now I just need to find Futch. Futch? Dutch? Futch? Futch? I don't know what the hell his name is. Really? Are you sure? Of course I'm sure. There's no way I could be wrong. Akute Mountain is a long ways north of here, but my friend went there and said he heard a dragon. And my wife's brother said he saw a dragon's shadow in the clouds. Really? Really? Awesome. I have to go see for myself. What? You can't go there. The mountain is full of monsters. Oh, shit. He ran off. <laughs> oh, well. Now we just need to activate something. Hey, Humphrey. Did he go somewhere? I'm a little worried. Okay. Where did that Kent kid go? He isn't at home. Jeez, I guess we'll have to wait till tomorrow. Did he go somewhere? Yeah, let's go. Okay. I'm tired, so let's do it later. What? Uh, okay. Okay, so, Kent, and being a stupid kid, fucking wandered off to go, I'm gonna go see dragons at a dangerous mountain pass. <laughs> stupid kid. God damn it. You know, there's being a kid and being like, oh, that's kind of innocent. Just being plain stupid. It looks like Kent made a new friend, a dragon knight. He said, is that a Matilda knight? It's tough work transporting milk to rock axe, but Kent tries really hard. That Kent has been goofing off and playing when he should be delivering the milk. I need to give him a good scolding. Do we... Hey, you two. My father's member of the Honorable Red Knights, but well, lately he hasn't been able to come home. My dad hasn't come home in a long time. I wonder what's going on with the Night Dumb. So the Night Dumb is doing stupid things, apparently, and making people question what the hell they're doing. That's a good sign. Right, let's see what happens. With this. You're staying another night? My, it looks like you've taken to our little town. Rest well. Oh no, Kent. Kent. Kent didn't come home last night. It's not like him to run away. Hmm? Uh, that kid. <laughs> it's just a rumor, but. A rumor? 
I just couldn't stop talking about the dragons. And someone said they saw one at Rakute. At Rakute? That's the area. is crawling full of powerful monsters. Why would he... This is my fault. Because I told him about Black. Because I promised him a ride. Now Kent is in trouble. Let's go. Huh? Don't you want to go save him? Uh, of course. To return the favor, I'll come. Huh? Who are you? It's Mr. Fist, Sir Humphrey's new friend. <laughs> Humphrey has friends? Thanks for your help, Lord Fist. We'd better hurry. Rakute Mountain is just north of this town. Don't get lost. Walker. He's not he's not too weak. But now I gotta kick someone out. Uh Yeah, Ulan, I guess. Ah, fudge, fuck you, man. Ah, and I can't toss him in. Yeah, whatever. I see. Oh, huh? well, later on. Oh, see you again, boy. What? No, ass. But yeah. Well, Humphrey's just a powerhouse, isn't he? Excuse me, ma'am. How do I get to Rakute Mountain? Alright, well, I need to get some, uh. Get some shit if I'm gonna head up there. Oh, well, luckily I've got money to blow, so that's good. Uh, that should keep us alive a little longer. And let's just buy a few of these. Yeah, it doesn't heal me all the way, but... It is just nice to have. Alright, guys, let's go save some idiot child. This Lord Fist happens to just kind of get caught in the midst of all problems with other people. But I'm a people person. I please everyone. Because I have a rune on my right hand that says, Hey, everybody, look at this guy. Let's tell him all our problems. Fudge. Ass. Luke, your stupid marshmallow didn't protect. Oh, Jesus. Oh, that's not bad. Okay, this is some bullshit. Knock it off. So Humphrey has more health than Victor, but they're equal strength. Oh, I hate going through magic. So I won't do it. Yet. I can't do that. Yet. I'm gonna go beat on one of them. There you go. <laughs> oh sure, now you try to act like a badass. Fudge, you jerk. I'm not healing you guys. Survival of the fittest. You're a detriment to the team. I don't remember the phantoms being so hard. But maybe this is a precursor to how this next part is gonna be. May God have mercy on my soul. Alright, well, on a good note, to continue, the way continues work is I think you lose a little bit of progress, but you get to keep all your experience. So it works out. 
Lord Fist. Please be careful. Monsters are looking everywhere. Hold on, Kent. We're coming to save you. I was a dragon knight, you know. Dismissed. What's going on? We'll never make it now if we don't hurry, Kent. What is this? A magic barrier? What should we do? Black, please help me, Black. Oh, his old Dargan helped. The mist! The mist is receding! Did you do that, Sir Fist? The rune's power! Let's go! Yes, it was me. Even though my tune just stood there kind of like... I don't know where we are, guys. Spikers. Spiky spiders. Oh my Jesus Christ, they hit so hard. Oh, son of a bear. Oh God, they don't give that much experience. Oh, sweet googly moogly, this is going to be bad. <laughs> well, we got to just soldier on. I mean, I need the experience. I need the... Yeah, at least Fist can take some damage, though, so that's... That's a good thing. Kind of. I can handle the abuse, guys! I am the leader of the castle, you know! Blood. I hope this isn't Fist's blood. You know, I actually need to go and get all the treasures here because you can't come back. At least to my knowledge, you are unable to once you leave. Or once you save Kent. This. So I'll toss that. Put the sun badge on, so at least I heal some. Take the boots off of him. Put on some shoulder pads, and Nanami will put on a cape. Yeah. Jesus Christ. I don't remember this area being so hard. I think as I usually wait till end game to get this. Oh, shit. There it goes, where did Fist go? Shit, man, I don't know. Oh. Oh, shit. No. You. 
Uchi. Oh well. That was fucking awful! <laughs> oh my god! We all got carried away except for except for one guy! Oh guys, this is bad! <laughs> just just kill them all, Luke. Just calling yourself Cool Hand Loop. I don't know why the hell they call himself Cool Hand Luke. Okay, I remember being able to max out on money here really fast, like in a few fights. Does this place scale to your level? Am I just going losing my mind? Okay, no, me. Let's kick the shit out of Hawkman. I don't know, you're not defending. <laughs> you're casting Foxfire, buddy boy. Fudge level up a little bit and being less stupid with my magic has made this a little easier. I don't know how this boss battle would be. Actually, now I think thinking about this upcoming boss battle, I have no idea how it'll pan out. Oh, away another item. Oh, fuck that. I'll throw away a gauntlet. I could use a skill ring. Plus, guard ring. Get it the skill ring because it ups my. Actually, no, let's give that to Victor. Yeah. Actually, can I do best equip? This should at least give my guys better uh, a better armor selection is what I'm trying to get at. Healing wind fully heals one person. Oh, oh he had one. Feeding everyone sandwiches we stole from Wakaba. I mean. No, I stole those sandwiches, man. <laughs> she packed them all nice and good. She's like, I have lunch food now after my good workout. Doing a thousand push-ups and, and crunches. And then she's going to go for her sandwich. And she's going to be like, where, where'd, my, where'd my Sammy's go? And then she'll be like, Sir Fizz took him. That son of a bitch. I don't really use the bottom two, but I don't. I don't want to get beaten up by little fucking fairy girls again. I did not know they would do 200 damage to a kid with a marshmallow on a stick. Don't 
Oh, okay, 198. Oh, that's so much better. <laughs> I mean, they don't... They don't have much health, but they're just... They're mean as shit. Oh, Pixie, thanks. Thanks, little Pixie girls. I can't put that on anyone... yet. Victor doesn't use a sword because technically his weapon is two-handed. Where the fuck am I going? You know what? Oh. The journeyman crystal is shining. Do you want to save? Yeah. I got some goodies here. I don't need to return. I'm getting my ass handed to me. But on a good note, you know, at least, at least I have fun stories to tell. Kent, why are you sleeping on the job? That's Kent over there. Wait. You hairy bitch. Yeah, let's just cast that. Make sure everyone is just blanket healed. And now me. Protect us from magic, Luke. Yeah, reflect anything she casts back. Just as good as a wall, man. Cannon, son. Oh, fluff. Okay, one sec. Stupid phone. A number I don't even know. Stop dropping my guys! Stop kicking them in the face! that because Fist keeps getting kicked in the face I'll have to heal him Luke blast her again I saw she used magic Damn it! She's getting hit by conventional weapons like it's nothing. Just heal everyone, screw it. Oh, well, he didn't drop 
victor this time. Yeah, buddy, that technical ring came in handy. Or the skill ring. Let's see, we'll attack her with that. That, that. Luke. You do you, Marshmallow Boy. This boss is insanely easier than any enemy I fought getting up to her. She's really just a time sink at this point. She doesn't... I could have sworn she cast some sort of magic. Okay. I remember this fight being a lot harder than her just using two stupid moves. I feel so ridiculous. Oh, here we go, see? That's what I was waiting for. But Luke was ready. Oh, I didn't do shit. So, what I'll do... I'm gonna try to berserk people. This may or may not work. Uh, Luke, uh, just set her on fire, bud. You weak little marshmallow boy. All right. Well, at least I don't feel ridiculous now. Yeah, buddy. And I have healing for days. <laughs> Go ahead, blast your magic, you butthole. Back to your old ways there, Harpy. Just gonna do that, do that, do that. Have Nanami heal us. And Luke will just set the chicken on fire.
sure has a lot of health. <laughs> That's right, Fist. That was all you, buddy. On a good note, though, we did get a decent amount of experience. And, and an okay amount of money, I guess. You came to save me, Fudge? There's no dragons here, but the rumor was total bull. You should know better, Kent. But what if there was? And if I had a friend who was a dragon knight, I could be proud. That's why. And I heard the dragon's cry when I was talked about. It's real, and it's just above here. That's why I ran up here. Then I fell and twisted my leg. It's okay now. There, you see? How did you get here? Look, it's black scale, the charm Fudge gave me. When I prayed to it, the mist lifted. So there must be a dragon here. Black scale? So what's that? So that's Im So what's important is you're safe. Let's go home. No, Fudge. I heard the dragon's cry. Last night, there was a tremendous beating of wings and a cry that could, be, that could split stone. It was just a head. There might be a dragon right there. Let's see. There's no way there'd be a dragon around here. And even if there was, but what if there is? Even if there was... Let's go see. Lord Fist, will you stay with us a bit longer? There's no dragon here. Come on, hurry up, Fudge! So you twisted your ankle, took a nap, and now you're better. I was right. It's an egg. A dragon's egg. It has to be. Dragons only lay their eggs in dragon caves. Then what's that? There's no other egg that looks like that. And with this, you can become a real dragon knight again. A dragon's egg. Captain Joshua of the Dragon Knights once told me. Even though dragons only lay eggs in dragon caves, once in a while a wild dragon appears. If we could find out why, we could probably breed new types of dragons. I was headed to the Great Shrine in Crystal Valley to try to find out more about that, but... But I never expected that in a place like this. Quickly, come over here, Futch. But... Look at it, Futch. It's a new dragon. No. I don't need a new dragon. Humphrey, Captain Joshua, they were all so nice to me. Everyone was, everyone was all concerned about me and hoping they could help me find another dragon. That's why I couldn't tell them the truth. I don't, I don't want to ride any other dragon besides Black. He was the only one for me. So I guess you don't need this egg or the beast to sleep inside it. I'll use my sword to destroy it. May... why? What's going on? Why would you do that? Dragon pups are weak creatures with no mother or knight to take care of... To take... To, to care for it, it'll weaken and die. And if it did live, but without a mon master, it would be no more than a monster that terrorizes humans. That's why you need to care for it. Come on, Fudge! Stop him! Oops. Wrong voice. <laughs> stop him, Fudge. Then you stop it, mister. It's a dragon's egg after all we've gone through. Wait, Sir Humphrey! Dragon, it's, it's so small. Fudge? Uh. I've never seen such a small dragon, and I've never even heard of a white dragon. But it's still a dragon, right? Yeah, it has to be. Don't you think so, Fudge? But I don't need... Then why stop me, Fudge? Uh. It wouldn't be a betrayal to have a new dragon. 
My memories of Black's deaths, of Black's death, are precious. But I won't have to forget that. And it's no reason to close the door on the future. Hmm. Fudge. There's nothing to be afraid of. Come here. I christen you Bright. <laughs> You're not very good at naming things, are you there, Fudge? Thank you, Lord Fist. I would like to repay your favor. If we can ever be of assistance to you, please ask. Fight with us. Of course, for you, I uh, will wield my sword again. I, Fudge, former Ninth Dragon, rank 17, will fight by your side. Yay! That was a whole episode! Fight hard, Fudge! Don't worry about me, Kent. Hey, the next time we meet, I'll be a Dragon Knight again. Really? Don't forget your promise. I won't. Okay. Okay, I almost forgot. Here, it's Black Scale. I'll, I'll give it back now. You keep it, Ken, as proof of my promise. Really? Is it okay? Really? Really? Wow, I'll, I'll, I'll treasure it. And, and I'll look forward to the day you come with your dragon. You do that. I swear that I'll return as a dragon knight. Let's go. Yeah, take it easy, Kent. Bye, Fudge. Okay. What? Get? What the hell are you guys doing? Quit dicking around with my formation. Yeah, buddy. Humphrey and Fudge. <laughs> My name's Fudge, and I act Butch. <laughs> okay, so with that, um, we'll call it for now. Yeah. Alright guys, this is Fist Lab signing out. Y'all have a good one.